Trump world erupts amid reports Kellyanne Conway trashing J.D. Vance. The Independent Staffer claim damaging leaks about Vance are 100% from Conway. Below are your comments. Both parties went into July with the worst possible candidates, both only capable of winning against the other and losing to any alternative. Democrats saw the writing on the wall and did what needed to be done. Republicans tried their best to eliminate Trump, but now they are stuck with him and see more. Donald Trump, he promised to cut the deficit. He added $8 trillion to it. Promised to build a wall. He only did 458 miles out of 2,000. Most of it was repair or replacement, not new. He promised to make Mexico pay. He promised to unveil a new health care plan. It didn't exist. He promised a middle class tax cut. He cut taxes for the rich. The middle class is paying for it. He said he wouldn't play golf as president. He made 250 visits, way more than Obama, to his own golf clubs. It cost taxpayers $150 million. He said he'd increase economic growth by 4%. President Biden did. He promised an infrastructure plan. He had none. President Biden signed a massive one. He promised to hire the best people. He fired three quarters of them and then said they were the worst ever. He promised to bring down the price of prescription drugs. He didn't, President Biden did. He promised a Hillary lockup. It didn't happen. Promised we'd win the trade war with China. We didn't, it cost about a quarter million jobs and hurt Americans did not help them. He promised his corporate tax cuts would help and benefit workers and corporations would use that mo. Nay to invest in American workers. They didn't, they used that money to buy back stocks. He promised to bring back and revive the coal and steel industry. Never happened, more coal and steel industry jobs were lost during his presidency. He promised to drain the swamp. He didn't, he was the swamp. January 6th, never forget. Dot. Seven days and this thing flipped, Harris took over, and the main thing is that it was predictable, which H still caught J.V. Dunce and his boss flat-footed and lost. Just think how bad they would run their office. Harris is accelerating even without a VP yet, and the father and son bumblefest is rapidly declining. Almost at the same rate. This means that the more they appear, they lose, and the more she appears, she wins. Good for her and she deserves it. The VP selection will solidify this movement. Loyal and law-abiding Republicans, Democrats and Independents have had enough of this demented old C. Rook. Enough doom, gloom, insults, vindictiveness and talk of decline, which this rich kid has been ranting.
G about since the 80s. What nonsense. America possesses the most powerful economy, military and culture in the world. We have always been a young and dynamic country looking forward, not one stuck in a half-imaginary P. Asked where women and minorities knew their place. Trump listened to Don Jr. Huge mistake Vance only appeals to the people who were already going to vote for Trump and he Aliena. Tay's independents and moderate Republicans. The ones Trump likes to offend by referring to them are Reno's. Please subscribe to my channel. And if you like it, please thumbs up.